10 over 100 is equal to 20 over N. Diba? Ganyan ang ginawa for direct. And we're going to cross multiply. So 10 times N is equal to 100 times 20. 100 times 20 is what? Huh? 2,000. Okay, so 10 N. And then we're going to isolate N, right? So we divide it by 10. 10 divided by 10 is what? 200. 2,000 divided by 10. And so we're going to that is two. So, for every 10 oranges, may 100. 20 oranges, 200. Tuma tumaas yung tumaas yung bilang ng oranges, tumaas din yung pressure niya. Ganun ang direct. How about indirect? Hmm. How about indirect? As one term increases, the other term increases. Okay. Opposite naman sila. So, let, let's take... This is an example. Okay. An amount is shared equally among nine people and each of them gets 480. So, meron daw na nine people. Open your book on page 189 para makita nyo. Letter B. Let's work together. Okay, so, nine people daw, each of them gets 980. Okay, let's write the given first. Ano daw yung given niya? O, makikipaig niya. So, 3 is to 5 is to 2. This one is the given. Oh, makinig. Yung hindi kahapon nakapunta. Okay? So, ang gagawin nyo, pangalawa, you have to get the total. Okay? Get the total. What is the total? 10. Okay, 10. Kasi, we added 3 plus 5, plus 2. Okay? So, yan ang una nyo ang gagawin. Ay, pangalawa. Write the given, and then, get the total of the ratio. Okay? Naintindihan ba? Next, what are we going to do next? Okay, make fraction form. So, 3 over 10. So, yan natin tinotal yung ratio para makuha natin ang denominator. Okay? Oy, jeez! Kaya yung dalawa, mamaya na naman, tatanungin nyo, hindi ko na naman na, ito na yan. Ano? Iyang-iya naman ako sa inyo, no? Ha? 5 over 10, and 2 over 10. Okay? So, after this, ano gagawin natin? Okay, ba paano nyo naman nalaman ko, ano yung ibang multiply? O, tingnan nyo sa libro nyo, mga ganun yung mga... Oh. Ano yung total na nakalagay dyan? 69! Okay. Doon nyo siya i-multiply yung bawat fraction form. Dapat may makita kayo yung total dyan. So, remember multiplication of fractions by a whole number? This is always equal to uh, as a denominator of 1. Diba? So, multiply 3 times 69. 207. 207. kayo, 207 yan. Divided by 10, so this will be? 20.7. 20.7. Next, 5 times 69. 130. 130. Three hundred forty-five divided by ten. Ah, oh, ano? Thirty-four point five. Next, two times sixty-nine. One thirty-eight over ten. Thirteen point 
So let's add it up. 20.7, 34.5, and 30.8. What is the total? What is the sum? 69. 69. Ano? 69. Okay, 69. Pero tao itong natin eh. So? 69 men. Huh? Okay, So let's round it off. 20.7 is rounded off. 21. 34.5 is rounded off. 35. 30. 30.8. 14. Okay, 14. Tignan mo nga kung nag-69 pa rin. 7. So sobra yan. 7. Ha? 70. So may isa tayong babawasan dito. 7.5. Ha? Itong 5. Kasi siya yung may pinakamababa. Buwasan natin ng isa. Para maging 69 pa rin. Okay? Ganyan ang pag-estimate. Kasi ang tinutukoy dito ay tao. Okay? Ano daw yung ratio na? Ano daw yung 3? Ano daw yung nandyan? Yung 3. Men. ba? Lalaki daw to. Ito ay, ano yung 5 na ratio? Women. Women. Ito daw? Children. So, ilang daw yung men? Ilang daw yung men? May 21 na men. Okay, ganyan kayo pag nag-answer, ha? 34 na men. Women. Okay, 14 na children. Children. Okay, naiintindihan ba? Try number five. 